Hello guys, Edgar with Pandora.com, and I'm sorry we have Mari in the background, it's just Google TV, you know, has all these things, um, but you, you kind of have to see the TV for now. Anyways, what's that? That's weird. World, okay, that's less distracting. Anyways, today we are checking out um, social Google TV or social GTV. Um, there's a problem with social eyes, which actually is my favorite out of the two, which are these like kind of social Twitter applications for Google TV. But uh, if you open this one, like it used to work out all right. But um, let's say I'm like right now, I believe it's Mari. So if I, I can search here for Mari and what it would do is show the tweets right on the screen. But right now, I don't know what happened. There's been no like reviews for like many months and the tweets are not showing. So I guess it's time to replace it. Uh, it was working before. I don't know what happened. But if we go to social GTV, which is another replacement, um, you get this little interface, which is pretty simple. It just tells you straight out what's going on. You can uh, show tweets, which is obvious. You can you can switch the settings and you can switch the appearance and you can go to live TV and exit. If you go to show tweets, it'll show the tweets, of course. So I believe the last time I searched it was Mari stuff. So yeah, see, if you go to live TV here, you can then see the tweets while you're there. And this is not Mari anymore. But you get the point. You can put anything in there. So we go back, press back, and you'll find the screen again. And right here you can go to the settings. And you can check out everything that's going on. So right here you can search for keywords. You can you can get stuff from the username. So let's say I want to get, uh, I don't know, what's up. Let's put mine in. At tech easy. And it'll probably show a bunch of my tweets. Let's get rid of this one. And then we press back. And then show tweets. And let's see what happens. Alright. Load them. Start loading. Come on. No tweets match the current search terms. So I haven't tweeted in a long time. So that's, that's probably why. But... It'll show you the tweets. Oh, let's see. Let's just put in Fandry. At Fandroid. Back. Let's go to Live TV. Oh, I was supposed to say show tweets. Okay, loading initial tweets. That's all right there. It's showing the tweets from that specific. So if you're watching a show, for example, that's, I don't know, the Grammys, I don't know, and uh, they happen to have a Twitter account, you can just put it in and they'll tweet everything in there. And you can put multiple. You can just put a comma. You can put a comma. And the same goes with the hashtags, the usernames, uh, or when you're going to tweet, when you want to find something that's tweeted to someone or from someone, you can just put there, you can put multiple, you can put keywords anything really so it's pretty cool and you can set the settings here how, how often do you want to refresh it don't repeat because sometimes they keep like rolling in the same tweets over and over block offensive words hide retweets etc set language trend lookup so these are like the trending topics on the hashtags and so i want to have sex with okay um Ways to piss off your Valentine, Happy V Day, Mac is my Valentine, etc., etc. So you can set that. You get the point. I right here. You can go to adjust tweet appearances. You can put it on the top, on the bottom, on the left, on the right. The, the icon. Um, how big do you want the icon? Right here, if you see, you can make it smaller and make it disappear pretty much, and that'll be the icon of the user. So it'll show a picture of whoever that is. And right here, the background color, how transparent do you want it, what color. Of course, I don't want it that color, but here, and the tweet duration, how how long you want it to stay there. So I don't want it to stay that long. Anyways, uh, let's make it 10. And how big you want the words, of course. Well, I, I usually keep it at like 22. It's like a good balance, and it doesn't get, you know, intrusive. And you can change the font 
and then you press save and you go back so that's pretty much it it'll show you the tweets and uh it'll give you access to your social stuff so you can get social and stuff uh it's not as good as socialize in the way that uh that you can't really you can't sign in with your twitter account and like sign or check in to say hey i'm watching this show you can't answer to the people that are tweeting you can't you know you're, you're pretty much limited to seeing what's going on in there but in the absence of social eyes which did all of that um we kind of stuck with this one and i i like it i mean it's just not as complex and it doesn't allow you to do as many things but it's always fun to look at what people are saying on twitter and you can join the conversation on your phone while you're watching this on your tablet on anything so yeah, just wanted to show this to you guys. Um, let me know what you think. Are you having problems with socialize? Um, are you have? I did you have to go to this one instead? Do you like social Google TV? So blah, social GTV. Sorry. Um, let me know in the comments. Uh, I'll write a quick post, uh, an article on GTVSource.com. So let me know in the comments. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you like it. And thank you for watching. Again, this is Edgar from GTVSource.com. Have a great day. Thank you.